Hey all, welcome to the video. So here's a fun adventure I took in uh, Spain a while back during the Semana Santa. And I visited Santiago de Compostela and Vigo in Galicia. And my first stop in Santiago was the famous town market, which is right in front of us. All right, I just left the market. I don't know if you can hear me or not, because I'm on the street. But I didn't get anything, but I did get a lot of footage, and it was very fun. But um, they just had a lot of fruits, veggies, and fish and meat. So nothing that I'm gonna you know, take home in a few days, but it was very fun. I don't know if you'll be able to hear me, but it's actually up here in this area. That's where it is. Got my coffee over there. I have my um, Neapolitana key, and then I'm just in this beautiful park. The park is called Parque Almeida, and then after I eat, I'm gonna go over there and explore, and you'll get to see that. Pretty sure that's the main cathedral here. But you can see how different the buildings are. They look all... I don't know, it looks more like England, honestly. So the Alameda Park was, I think, one of my favorite places to go. It was just like full of all these statues of poets and everything and lots of old people just enjoying their time and it was just a really sweet place. Okay, so I just got myself my, my ticket to go to Vigo, and now I'm heading to the bus station to get one to go to Finisterre. Also, here's like the bridge from the train station, which you can't see, but it's kind of right there to the bus station. Well, the train station is. This is the train station. It's so old. It's so pretty. And then that's like the city of culture of Galicia, which I'm going to try and go to. I'm just walking home. Did some purchases. Breathe it heavy. Look how pretty the city is. It's just so different. Alrighty, so I am all ready to go to the museum <laughs> and that's all i did today and i think i'm just gonna come home and chill well. so the second day that i was in santiago i stopped by the museum of the galician people and basically uh just showed that galicia has been inhabited for thousands of years which is really cool and um there's still a lot of pre roman settlements especially in vigo which you'll see later on um but basically galicia has just always been about fishing and getting them fishes and uh, also Zara um, was invented there. So that's just a little bit about Galician history and I guess um, fast fashion as well. So, woo. Here's more of the city. Look how beautiful that is. And it's just, oh God, it's so neat here. I'll zoom out a little bit. Just look at all this, this is so pretty. So. I didn't realize this was such a hike, but I'm going up all the way there to see the Ciudad, Ciudad de la Cultura. This is like so tall. Like, it's hard to tell, but it's, it's, it's quite large. I'm also lost, so I have no idea where I am. Okay, <laughs> I'm lost. Uh, I think I'm lost, but it's very pretty. And there's just a bunch of buildings and there's no doors. So. <laughs> um, I don't know what to do. Also, you probably can't hear me because of the wind. So look at this view. The 
This is beautiful. Like, oh my god. This is the city, this is so pretty. And then behind me, this is the museum and I'm trying to figure out how to get in. Um, but I have absolutely no idea. Okay, I made it inside, so now I'm gonna explore. isn't breaking me up too bad, but um, oh my god. Just got to the museum and then I'm gonna go in whatever this is. Again, sorry about the wind, but something really cool I just learned is that um, the like air ventilation pipes for the building, because it's like Oh, this is underground. There's a lot of underground stuff. Or actually what those towers are, so that's why it looks kind of creepy and everything. So this is me on the way to um, the second city, Vigo. I honestly forgot to record the other things I did in, in Santiago, but it wasn't too much. So I'm on my way to Vigo and it's about 500,000 people. It's like the biggest city, I believe, or the second biggest in Galicia. And um, in the city, I just kind of explore got some great food, and got to see some great beaches. So I hope you guys enjoy, um, because I sure did. Hey guys, so I'm just about to leave, um, but fun thing is that my host mom's mom lives here in Vigo, and so she's going to show me around, which is really neat. I look kind of weird because I just cut my hair. I'm not sure I like it, but I'm walking up to the Castro. 